Oh, hello everyone, my name is Cole Stanley and today I will be talking to you guys about the PlayStation 4. I'm sure a lot of you guys have heard of it. It's a very popular device, but an also amazing device. So, did you know that Sony, since 2013, when they came out with the PlayStation 4, has sold over 70 million? It's an amazing number. And they're around like $300, so you do the math. You make a lot of money. So, I'm going to adjust three points first, and then I'm going to go into their biggest competitor and address that. So, uh, first one being is that it's a great way to relax and there's very fun filled games. Number two is you can use communication while using the PlayStation 4. And thirdly is there's access to hundreds of apps. So it's not only just for gaming, video gaming and all that stuff. So the first point being, it's a great way to spend time recreationally. I do it, uh, I think all my friends do it. I know a bunch of people that do it. So, the one thing that you can do recreationally is, you know, you know, giving a great speech, you come home, you know, tired, you just want to get some Whataburger or something, just sit down and play your favorite game, whether that's uh, Madden, Fortnite, it's really popular right now. Uh, I know my sister, she made me buy Dance Dance Revolution so she could play it on mine, so, you know, it's, it's, so it's good for everyone. Another thing you can also do on it is you can make a pretty good living playing video games. I know, it's crazy. So. For the Madden tournament in 2017, they handed out or $1 million in prizes alone, and that is according to esportsearnings.com. So with the popular game being Fortnite right now, and the PlayStation 4 offers this, Ninja, he's a popular streamer. I don't know if you guys have heard of him. So like within the last calendar year, uh, his net worth has skyrocketed to over $6 million in just one year, which is absolutely crazy. So, could be one of you guys sitting in this room today if you buy one. So, it allows you to communicate with your friends. So, I know with iPhones uh, and all that stuff, you can FaceTime, uh, Skype on laptops. I know it's kind of outdated. But one reason I love to do it is all my friends have PlayStation 4 and you can use party chat. You don't have to be in the same game. You guys can be playing totally different games. But you can keep up on live, communicate, see what someone's doing that weekend. Maybe they're going home and you want to go home as well. And with uh, Madden, Fortnite, all the other games, you can meet online and play people head to head and maybe that person's really good and all your other friends aren't very good at the game and it's not fun because you beat them all the time so you want to play that person. You just hit a button, send a friend request and you just made a new friend. So it's always good to have another friend in life. Uh -oh. Thirdly, there's hundreds of apps apps to use, whether it's watching movies, sports, whatever you can think of, it's on there. Uh, I know for me, I have Netflix and ESPN, those are my top two apps on there. And according to CNBC, the average person spends around 10 hours a week on Netflix. So another great reason to buy this PlayStation 4. Um, and so now going into the competition, you know the Wii was kind of there for a little bit, but now it's outdated. Uh, so the biggest one right now would be Microsoft with the Xbox One, since that's the newest model. Uh, so when you're looking at price, the PlayStation 4 is going to be around $300 for the lowest gigabyte, which is $500. And the Xbox One is going to be $275. And this is according to Amazon. So the, P the PlayStation 4, since it's bigger and it ha has made more money, it has uh, the rights to more video games and all this stuff, apps and all that good stuff. So it's one plus for them. And the Xbox One has only sold 19 million compared to the 70 million that PlayStation 4 has sold. So both great consoles, but as you can see, a lot of people like the PS4. I uh, can't blame them, I'm an owner, I love it. Also the PlayStation 4 is gonna have better graphics, so when whether you're watching those movies or you're playing your games, you're gonna be able to see them better. So. In conclusion, the PlayStation 4 is going to meet all your needs, whether that's you're playing video games recreationally, you know, you're tired of going to college and you want to drop out and make some quick cash, it can do that for you as well. Whether it's communicating with uh, old friends that you've had since high school or making new friends, and it'll also give you access to hundreds of apps. So thank you very much, and if anyone has any questions.